Hi there, I'm Quinta Brunson and I'm going to be showing you my nighttime routine. Are you ready to go to bed with me? Let's go. I care about my nighttime skin routine because I think it's just as important as the morning skincare routine. You have to hydrate your skin at night, you have to protect your skin at night, you have to recharge your skin at night. Also, I mean, the biggest thing in the world is washing my face at night. You are carrying so many toxins and germs with you from throughout the day. I just have to get them off of my face before hitting my pillow. Also, if you don't wash your face, then you're gonna be putting all the products that I'm gonna show you over top of dirt. You don't wanna do that. You want the dirt gone. I use a makeup remover, usually something oil-based to get the makeup off. Then I go over my face with a nice clean white washcloth. Does it have to be white? No. But I like white because it feels cleanest and if there is any leftover residue on my face, I can see it and I like that. I'm going to be using one, two, three, four, five, six, seven products today, including my scrunchie, because I think it's a good idea to put your hair back when you're gonna be doing this stuff. All right, it's back and I'm ready to get to night timing. The first thing I'm gonna be using is Olay Retinol 24 Eye Cream. This is great. I do a lot during the day. I wake up at 5 a.m. and then I have to work for a long period of time, whether that be in the writer's room or in the production office or on set actually acting. I get some pretty significant bags underneath of my eyes, as you can see. This eye cream, I just put it under here and kind of give it a quick rub in. The reason I do this is because I really want these bags to not be there when I wake up. Retinol not only helps um, enhance your skin, which is starting to look dull and lose its stretch because we're getting older girls and that's okay, but it helps bring it back to life. I use the Olay Retinol 24 Serum. What's great about this line is I love keeping it all in the family. I can really trust that these things are gonna work together to recharge my face as I sleep. I like to put it all over my face and my neck. And serums just feel like they're doing that extra layer of work under your moisturizer. I think it's really important to use one. You don't have to, but they help and I like them, so why not? After I use my serum, it's time to moisturize. My favorite, favorite part. And I like to do that with the Olay Retinol 24 Moisturizer. I love this because it's light, easy to use, creamy, and it's Olay, I trust it. This just feels so good. This moisturizer really feels like silk. It feels like you're putting a layer of silk on your face. And I think that's just, such a good feeling. I don't like going to sleep with a heavy moisturizer Then I feel like my face is gonna to stick to the pillow. This isn't bad at all. The best thing about this moisturizer is it's kind of like a nap dress for your face. It just feels like you're putting something on to help recharge your skin for the morning time. Then when I wake up, if I wanted to, I feel like I can just get up and go. My skin honestly looks recharged, hydrated, it looks supple and well taken care of. And I really, really love that. So I'm big about maintaining around my eyes. So I take the nighttime as a huge, huge time to fix whatever's going on here. I get baggy and puffy eyes a lot. Because of that, I like to use the Peace Out Puffy Eyes um, Eye Mask. I think they're really great. For most people, the goal is to depuff, but I actually think I get really, really crazy bags and these help kind of lift those bags away. So I just apply these bad boys. There we go. They're nice, they're creamy. Okay, then I apply the other one. And then I let these sit for the recommended 15 minutes. It's nice. If you want to, you can even jade roll over these. My makeup artist does that. I don't really know what it does, but it makes me feel good. I kind of already have very plump lips, so I don't really need help in that department, but I like to use the Lawless Forget the Filler Overnight Plumping Mask because I always like to put something hydrating on my lips anyway. I feel like we often neglect the lips at night, but they need hydration just as much as any other part of your body, and this is a great one. So now that my skin is all moisturized and my lips are plump and everything is doing that, I wanna talk about what I normally do with my hair before I go to bed. One product I love is Bread. Bread is a line of hair care products. This is their 
Curl Defining Leave-In Conditioning Curl Cream. I love this cream. When my hair is in its natural state and kinky and coily, this is a wonderful defining cream. I've used so many, and I think it's outstanding that this line somehow stands out amongst the crowd. It's just light, delicate, defining. It's really good. For all my natural hair girls out there, this is the one you wanna pick up. And then I also love using Bread's hair oil. Bread's hair oil was sent to me as a gift during the pandemic and I was like, what is this? But then I decided to use it one day. I have never looked back. With all natural ingredients, this is like one of the best oils I've ever found. Anyone else I talk to who uses this says the same thing. So if you don't know, you know now. Use the bread hair oil. So thank you everybody for joining me. Now you can leave because I've done my nighttime routine. So it's time for me to go to bed. Bye.